What up, what up? Hey man, big shout out to Classic Barbers. You know what I'm saying? Always hooking it up with the fire ass cut. Look at this shit. Big shout out Classic Barbers, man. Ooh, the fade, bro. Look at the details on this shit. Look at that lineup. Crazy, man. She told me take a deep breath. You too worried about being the best out. Woo! It's been a crazy couple days. Crazy things have happened in the last literally like 24 to 48 hours. I've been working on a couple pretty insane business deals, one of which is about to close, and it's the biggest business deal I've ever done in my life, so I'm, I'm fucking super excited for this shit to close. Do our poke real quick, hit let it breathe, we're gonna pick up some champagne, and then head home. Ooh, what we got? All finished. Damn. It's all done, you should have done it at the beginning. Shout out to me though. What's up, gang? We just got to Walmart. Your boy broke his fucking glasses. Look at this shit. It's so sad. They hit the beach, bro. It's hot as fuck today. Better get in the water. Make sure you guys go check out Shop Division, divisionclothing.co. Let's get it. Today, we are doing something fucking crazy. I never thought this day would come, bro. If you guys saw my video a couple weeks ago, I bought a Mercedes. I said I bought a Mercedes. And well, I went to Target and I bought a fucking GLA, a tiny little baby car, just as a fucking prank. Cause I was bored of shit and I have no friends. <laughs> but today's a crazy day because there's two things that have happened today which are insane. The first is your boy got these new glasses. Shout out to Ray-Ban, man. If you guys know me at all, I've had the Mercedes 2015 CLA 250 AMG in this gorgeous red, but it's time. It's time to, to get a Toyota, man. If you guys know anything about Indian people, we love our Toyotas, bro. My family's had the Camry, we've had the Corolla, we've had the fucking Corolla SE, the XE, the FE, the DEP, fucking, doesn't even matter, bro. We've had it. If it's a Toyota, we have had it, bro. So, today, I am buying a Toyota. Never thought this day would come, but it's time to get rid of the Benzo. It's not the Toyota that you guys think. We are getting the sickest fucking Toyota that has ever existed on this planet, guys. This is the dopest fucking car. Okay, we're gonna head over to Anaheim, Toyota dealership. Alright gang, we just got to Toyota. I'm looking at a couple of these, you know, I'm kind of fucking with this one. This looks like a nice car. You know, it's good for the everyday drive. My mom would probably sit in the back. You know, I think she, she'd probably like this one a lot. You know, what do you guys think? Is this the one right here? Maybe, maybe, let's keep looking. You know, maybe we go electric. Maybe we get something that's a little environmentally friendly. Good for the environment, nature. It's electric, you know, mom can sit in the back. It's got the dope ass rims. Maybe we go with the black version. You know, it's it's just a cooler version of this one. Or we could fuck around and get the 2020 or the 2021 Toyota Supra. Insane, check them out. Holy shit. Now that's what I'm talking about, baby. Look at this car, bro. Damn, that shit is crazy. What do you guys think, huh? I think we'll go with one of these two as opposed to the fucking mama mama soccer van car and the ugly ass Prius. I'm thinking we go with one of these bad boys, yeah? Beautiful 300 and something horsepower. What do you guys think, the red or the black? Should we go red? You know, it's got a nice little body. It's just such a sick car, bro. As you guys can tell, I'm not in the Toyota Supra. I did test drive the car. This is my first time ever driving it. And while it was super fun, the car is super fast. When I threw that bitch in sport, it went Skrrr! But the sales guy who was helping me just was not giving me the numbers that I needed him to get to. And he wanted me to trade in my Mercedes. He wanted me to put a bunch of money down. He wanted me to have a high payment. And it's just, it wasn't, the numbers just didn't make sense. I understand numbers, bro. I understand how cards work. I understand how leasing works. I understand how financing works. And it's just, it wasn't right. It just didn't make sense. Since I'm now very sad and disappointed 
I'm heading to the beach to go boogie boarding as well. It's Saturday and I got nothing fucking else to do. So let's just, you know, let's have a good day. It's fucking 100 degrees outside. Beach time. Let's get it. Ah. Hey man, you know we had to pull up to Bonsai Balls, man. Shout out to Bonsai. Always hooking it up with the gangster fucking Acai Balls. We got the Dekine today. Chocolate hemp milk. Almond. Uh, honey. Granola. Banana. Acai. Almond. Did I say almonds? Yep. The whole shebang. Look at that. Ooh. Let's go. It's beautiful. It was hot as fuck today, so it's just nice to be in the cold ass weather and shit. Look at this shit. Ooh. It's beautiful, bro. Alright, we're about to head to LA. We gotta go to dinner real quick with my parents. And we've got some crazy shit going on tomorrow. It's gonna be an epic, epic, epic Sunday. Let's get it. Uh, uh no. Is this yes. no. Right, guys, big, big, big shout out to the homies over at Gymshark for hooking it up with the Gymshark uh, merch. I coordinated the Impulsive Show. Again, big shout out to Jason and the homie Callum at Gymshark. They sent the, the full on care package. Even the cute little note. Thanks for organizing the Impulsive Show with Ross. Hopefully we can get more stuff done in the future of the Gymshark family. That's love, bro. They sent the dope ass gear. You know what I'm saying? The pants I got on the shirt. The shorts. I love you guys. Shout out to Ross Edgley. Shout out to the homies at Gymshark. I fucking love you guys. Ah. Okay, Sunday morning. We are heading over to Burbank. Your boy got to get tested because I got something crazy going on this week that I can't even talk about yet, but I have to get tested for it. So we're going to head over to the COVID testing center and get cotton swabs up our nose. Yeah.